God damn, you just got outplayed. I mean, you're a mirror and I'm a team app, but still. <laughs> I fucking. I baited the shit out of him. He really thought. How is it going, boys and girls? Darb guy here, and welcome back to another ranked one v one duel video. And today, we are doing something that's like a fifty fifty between fun and kind of cringe. Because you know, let's be realistic. Every time you see a team at, you know that there's going to be something cheesy going on. You know, team at doesn't team at players never play team at normally. There's always some weird niche that team at is able to just abuse for some reason i don't really know why but this is right now currently it's just tablet and um you might be wondering why why tablet you'll see this game okay team at is like a spam poke wave clear full commit he she is whatever she wants to be when she wants to be it not only is she very good at poking She's very safe, she's very good at clearing the wave, she has a stance switch, and she's a fucking tanky motherfucker when she's on all fours, okay? She's got a bit of everything, as well as her ultimate, her ultimate one, spawning little minions, and then those little minions will, like, fuck up the tower. She has basically everything, so today, I want to build just tablet team at. And get max tablet stacks, build a lot of mana, and just absolutely shred this poor Ymir. Now, it kind of sucks we're against a Ymir. Not really, actually. I was going to say it kind of sucks we're against a Ymir because he's tanky, but Tablet is true damage, so no matter how tanky it is, maybe it's good we're against a Ymir because we're going to be able to easily farm him for sex. So I think it's a good thing that we're against a Ymir. We kind of used everything, so hopefully our wave clear doesn't suffer too much. I want to clear this so it not get hit by anything. At the moment, I just want to clear the wave. Because I don't want to poke him for like a tablet. You know, there's nothing for me to... Poking right now does nothing. He has potions and he is genuinely tanky at this point. He's sitting around the corner. So yeah, I think this is a good match to farm stacks. And... Yeah, he used everything on me and nothing on the wave. Eating an entire fucking minion wave. This is horrible for him. And then we have our three coming up. Boom. Beads the... I thought he was going to spit, but he's still dead. Yeah, he entered that pretty hard. Uh, my base could have been better, I think. We'll stay to clear this wave. Did I beads his freeze, or did I beads his three? Because he did use the 3 and missed because of my beads. And I think if I didn't beads, I think i do die there. So I think it was a good beads. And we got the kill, so. We'll get the tablet. Start absolutely just farming him for stacks. That's the game plan. To poke him non-stop. But if you find yourself enjoying this video, make sure to let me know by subscribing. I'm really trying to hit 1k by the end of the year. And um, we're going to have a milestone. A um, goal at 750. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. Maybe it's going to be to get another character to level 10. Maybe it's going to be to get more high quality mic. We'll figure that out. But for now, let's just get there, okay? We can't, no matter what we do, you know, if we're not there, it's not going to matter. So let's fucking get there first. I just want to farm him for sex. Okay, you just walked in a straight line. He only hits me, which is not good for him. Oop. Okay. Little I thought... Okay, can you tell I don't play Tiamat? <laughs> I have two games of Conquest on Tiamat. That's it. I forgot that Tiamat has a separate ultimate in her fucking on-her-knees stance, you know? But it, I forgot that she does have a different ultimate. I was gonna throw down a tornado. Or minions. I mean, I don't really know. I didn't have a game plan, to be honest. I probably should have, but. You know what happens? Huge. We're just getting tons of stacks. That's all I wanna do. 
Throw some minions down, get some stacks. You know how it be. I also did not mean to put a point in my two as early as I did, just to clear up that, in case someone thought I did. I think I want to go immediately into my Book of Thoth. The sooner we get this stacked, the sooner we're actually going to be able to kill him. Because at the moment, the only time we're able to kill him is if he ints. So if he doesn't int, we have zero kill potential <laughs> at this point in time. But I mean, we're going double stacking, so it's not really like our goal is to kill him early on. So kind of expected, but you know, action. Dude, I love Tablet. Tablet's such a cool item. I want to hit the wave, but then hit him with a tick of my one just for the stack, but it's not high enough level two. Or I'm just doing it wrong. Maybe a mix of both. I wonder if he's sitting behind the corner. Whoa, he was sitting behind the corner? No way! Okay, that was a great time to disconnect game. I really appreciate that. I have 30 ping, by the way. 42 today, damn, that's up high. 42 is the highest my ping's ever been. And I'm still fucking disconnecting. Obviously, he has kill potential and we don't, so we're just gonna... Be careful. I don't mind giving up the red buff. We can get our Thermidians down to fuck up the tower a bit more, and then back to get our full book. I want to start stacking this immediately. This is going great. Could have asked for a better character to stack on, I don't think. Unless someone wanted to play like fucking Kefri. But I mean, that's not going to be fun, you know? Ymir can actually kill me. Kefri could not. Team is way too tanky for Kefri to do anything to him. Yeah, he just keeps trying to. Uh, I'm gonna the wave. He keeps trying to ignore the wave and hit me, which is horrible for him. I don't know why he's doing that. They're not minions, just to hurt the tower a bit more. The minions, by the way, due to the change, now minions can actually get me uh, tablet stacks. So if he's walking the lane and I have a minion jump on him from the fucking shadow realm, then then he will actually give the tablet stacks off that. Which would be nice. He tried to block my one that goes through walls with his wall. We are gonna have like literally no cooldown. <laughs> but I think that's fine. We're gonna full commit anyways late game. It's definitely not good. Don't let me fucking lie to you, okay? I'm not saying it's good. I wonder if he's behind the corner. Whoa, he was behind the corner? No way! How did that miss? Later game, I'm gonna probably instigate with my um, ground stance just so I can immune his fruits with my ult. Because my ult is CC immune. Like that. If I activate my 3 in the buff area, will it launch me so far back I go out? <laughs> no. Close to it. Okay, I'm gonna go with Pestilence. Just because I don't want to get a Divine or anything. So I'm just gonna go past you. Plus there's like 65 uh, Magic Prots. That is pretty damn good. I'm recording this hella early. It's like 8am right now, but that's just because I have Insomnia and I couldn't sleep. This man is... I don't think this guy's new to duel. He doesn't really seem to know what he's doing. 
No way he's faster than that. No way, why are you walking this way? You don't win the fight. Dude, this tornado is so slow. They need to make Team at Tornado go faster. Surprising he's not going defense. The only advantage he has right now is that he's tanky. So I feel like he should try to abuse that advantage early game. Cause like Yesimir has a good late late game, but so does Team at. I feel like I, if I just play my relics right, I just win late game no matter what. No matter what build I'm doing. Who do I know? I don't play team at, so maybe I'm wrong. Next item, I kind of want to go like a Bancroft, I think. A lot of mana. Some sustain as well. Mana, if you don't know, Book of the uh, Tablet of Destinies, I mean, scales off of mana, and so does Book of Thoth. So it's good to just have a shitload of mana. So, Bancroft's a good item, believe it or not. That minion way fucking ate me up though. Pretty sure this guy is relatively new to duel though. Obviously I'm not if I was like try harding, I'm not gonna be fucking jumping on him in middle in the front of like four minions. That's how he died in the beginning. I'm just trying to get as many tablet stacks as I can. That's my goal. That is a cool ass looking tornado though. Your middle tower is under attack. Did I throw a tornado on you? I didn't mean to ult that by the way, I just fucking fucked up. Our no cooldown is hurting. <laughs> he would die so many times if I just had the cooldown. I mean maybe not so many times, he is tanky 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 bro. The tankiest of all. I have minion. Boop. 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 Okay, we can get our Bankrofts, and then we'll go Typhons and have Pen. And then last item, probably Soul Reaver. Soul Reaver or Rod, I think, are both viable, but I think Soul Reaver is more aesthetically pleasing to look at, you know? So we're gonna see tablet rocks going everywhere. Why not add some Soul Reavers on top of that? That'll be beautiful. <laughs> That's all we got right there. I think, I think we played that fight perfectly. Teamite is such an annoying character. I'm full fucking HP. God damn, you just got outplayed. I mean, you're a Yamir and I'm a team app, but still. 
<laughs> I fucking I baited the shit out of him. He really thought. That's probably the intro clip. <laughs> Oh my voice just got out. It's going pretty well though. Hope your days are going well as well. I actually played a lot of Duel this morning because I woke up at like 6 a.m. because I couldn't I say I woke up liberally. I fell asleep at 3 and I woke up at 6. I got like three hours of sleep. So liberally woke up and I was just slamming some Artemis and Soul. I played two games of Soul Ethic and I won both, and then I played like four games of Artemis and I won all four. Um, and then I locked the game of Naja and I lost, believe it or not, to a fucking warrior. And he was the warrior was no offense to this guy, but he his record was one in six. Like he's very obviously not like the best. Like it's probably this Ymir level of player, right? So it's like obviously they shouldn't be obviously not like the highest tier player. In the final fight. I had a 3k pot, a 500 pot, both relics. I sashed in, beads his ultimate, he missed his stun, I reset, I sashed in, I ulted it, I beads his stun, I thorns, and then I hit 13 autos. I did 4300 damage. And he just fucking autoed me for 2208 autos. And I lost the game off. It was so- I like genuinely was upset. My mom was vacuuming, I hope you can hear that. I love- Naja is so fun and all, but holy shit, losing to fucking tanks just because they're tanks is not fun. That always feels bad. Oh shit. Oh shit. Okay, listen, I don't play Tiamat. Okay, don't laugh. Don't laugh. I don't play Tiamat. I forgot that I, I wasn't- I was on my fucking knees, bro. Hey, yo. Holy shit. Do 115 in auto. This phoenix is dead. It's crazy that I've been poking him all game for 15 and a half minutes and my tablet is still not stacked. But I mean, I guess tablet gets so much value late game that it probably should be... ...not the easiest thing in the world to stack. Imagine four stacking items on Tiamat. That'd be so cringe. I can go Tablet, Book of Thoth, Warlocks. There's a fourth item, right? Or am I dumb as hell? I think that's it. Is there another stacking item? I don't think so. Not for Magicals, at least. Oh my god, the Tablet. It's not even stacked yet. It has one more stack it needs. Oh no, buddy. You should be scared. It's doing 150 in ability. Boop. 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 I should have just stayed on him there, I think. He's about the corner. No, he's just fucking booking it, isn't he? I'm gonna beast this and just kill him. Be so tanky! Die! You notice, by the way, how he was 0 3 and he still thought he deserved my tower trying to fucking walk up. Dual players are something else. I want this bull demon, but Teamet does not have good bull demon shred at all. I mean, it's better than some. Okay, maybe it's not. This is bad. No, I'm a tornado. I didn't want the fucking dumb bull. I put his son in front of him. I put a tiny bull demon. I put my own bull demon there. How was that gonna help me? Remember in the Smite Pro League when the developers made the fire giant walk down mid lane? That shit was awesome. I wasn't around for that, but I saw a video of it, and it was awesome. They should, I wish they'd do shit like that nowadays. Instead, they just add Equinox to the game. And buff Hercules. Equally fun stuff, you know? Tablet is stacked, our book is stacked. We have a lot of mana. We have a Soul Reaver. This guy is about to not have fun.
This is an interesting ult. I don't have beads, so I hope he doesn't freeze me. <laughs> yeah, he just kind of ran it down. It's not getting him unless he's sure. Alright, well, I, I hope you all enjoyed, and I hope you all have an amazing rest of your night. Peace.